Hey everyone, welcome back to HGTV Handmade with me, Meg. Prom and wedding season are in full swing right now, and there's nothing better than making those that you love feel super special with a really fun photo booth backdrop so you can go home with some keepsakes of your special event. In today's video, we're making a DIY diamond for your wall that makes just a really cool little wall decor for your apartment or would be fantastic for your photo booth backdrop. So let's get started. You'll need 12 one inch nails, a leveler, colorful twine, and a hammer. First, you're gonna draw out your diamond onto a large piece of paper. You can use these measurements as a guide. Adjust to the size and scale that you want. Make the points where the lines meet more pronounced as they're all you're really gonna need anyway. Bring your paper diamond over to your wall. Use your leveler to make sure that it's straight. When the leveler bubble is right in the middle, tape the paper to the wall. Now you're ready to add nails to all of your points. Take your small nails and gently tap them into the wall on each point. Make sure that they go in straight and leave about a quarter of an inch to half of an inch sticking out of the wall. When all of the nails are in all of their points, carefully remove the paper without removing any of the nails. These are gonna be what you put your string on. Starting from the bottom point, take the end of your twine and tie it around that nail. Double and triple knot that puppy until it's secure. Pull the twine up to the next nail on the wall, keeping it taut, and wrap it around that nail. Continue pulling the twine to each nail around the perimeter of the diamond, pulling it taut, and wrapping it around each one. Create a straight horizontal line on the inner row of nails. Connect the first nail on that line with its corresponding nail on the top line. These lines should be diagonal like this. Push the thread that's on each nail towards the wall as you go to give you more room to work with. Continue on following along with me. When you finish with your first color of twine, tie the end and cut off the excess. At this point, you can leave it as is or bring more color and linear patterns into the mix. And now add your third color. Explaining this part will just get confusing, so just follow along with me. When you're done, tie off the end and cut off the excess. And voila! You have a modern geometric diamond on your wall. You can do this on a board and mount it if you're scared of making holes in your wall, but it's super easy to cover those holes with just a little bit of spackle. This makes for cool wall decor or a fun photo booth backdrop for a prom, bridal shower, or a wedding. 